Hi, everyone. We're here with the senior president, Mark Patty, and he's going to give our State of the Union address. This is the first one in MHS history, so this is pretty big. So to start off, how was your first day of school, car decorating contest? How was it being the president first day? You know, it was actually pretty nice the first day of school. I mean, like, being class president, you know, at, at the end of the day, I'm it's just... Nice. At the end of the day, well, at the end of the day, I'm just a normal guy, though. So I'm walking around like everyone else, seeing what everyone's cars are, seeing what the deal is. I mean, I mean, I just walked around my little, like, tea the whole time. Uh, but actually, the cars, I was very impressed with, like, our class and how, like, nice the cars were. Uh, the competition was very tough, very, very strict. I don't... I, I'm i sorry, I, f I forget who won. But the car that won, I remember being amazing. But what uh, was your favorite car? What was your my, personal favorite? What was my favorite car? Yeah. I'm going to be honest, I don't remember it well enough. Uh, if, I, if I had to come up with one off the top of my head... Uh, honestly, you know what I remember more than the specific cars? There were a lot of groups with, like, uh, custom T-shirts. I remember those groups as sticking out a lot, and, like, especially the cars with, like, the very nice line work, yeah. like, looking more like, a, you know, like, full. I gotta say, Milburn really overdoes it. Like, I've looked at Instagram posts of other schools, and anything, like, even winners of other schools are not nearly yeah. to anything we have at Milburn. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, the car decorating contest was great. Uh, afterwards, after the car decorating contest, we had the uh, senior photo, which was really the first time that the entire class was together just for one event. I mean, we all got t-shirts on. Yeah. It, it was the, uh, for, for you guys, uh, if you look in that photo, that is the only time you're ever going to see me in a t-shirt, not a polo shirt or a quarter zip. Uh, but Same yeah, thing with me. Big, yeah, yeah, big milestone for me. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, I think the photo turned out great. Everyone got a little shirt as a souvenir. So... It's a pretty big thing. No one else has done song selections before as president. Um, how has that been going, and are you getting a lot of good suggestions? Okay. I mean, you mentioned it's like the first time that the president has done it. It's not actually that big of a shift. I mean, I've, I've told this story before, so uh, Evan Shut. I may be missing a couple of details, but this is roughly true. So as far as I can remember, uh, Evan Scheidler was the first class president to have a shtick on the morning announcements. To be honest, I don't, even, I don't even remember who the class president was my freshman year. Uh, but I, I just remember him just saying, hello, today's whatever, here's Dr. Myron. Uh, Scheidler, with the language of the day, was really the first time the class president had a shtick, a thing, you know, something to, like, catch the uh, class's attention. Uh, so his was the language of the day. Uh, then uh, Joey Sorkin, the previous president. The quotes. Uh, yeah. No, no, no. His was the uh, his was like the national day of the day. Oh yeah, yes, national yes, yes. national hot dog day, national national day of the day. Whichever there's a they lot. They're always of, so there's random. A, there's a lot of day. National apple pie day. National like uh, pet your dog. Chocolate day. ice cream. National yeah. chocolate. You know that is the like the only thing the government can agree on making random national holidays. But anyways. Yeah, we have hundreds of them. We have hundreds of them. Politics aside, extremely important politics aside. Uh... You know, the, the song selections, I mean, I was just thinking about it one day. I thought, you know what, this would be a good shtick. I mean, if I'm limited to, like, seven or so seconds, that would be good. Uh, I, in the beginning of the year, I curated them. I tried to make a decent mix. I know everyone's not a fan of my music taste, but I, I, I try and keep it out of it, keep my music taste out of it as much as I can. Uh, but, yeah, afterward, you know, I, I really try and, like, pick song suggestions. I want to play what you guys want to play. Uh, so I try and include, like, a pretty decent variety there. Uh, yeah, that's basically how it's been so far. So in the Google form that you sent out, yes. have you seen any common interests for certain songs? Yes. There are a couple of songs that have been recommended a lot of times. I mentioned uh, Bohemian Rhapsody. That was the first song suggestion I played. I believe I got, like, 12 or so of them. Uh, there's a couple of joke songs that, like, you know, like funny songs that have been recommended a lot, but that I'm saving for a little bit later. So, if you catch my drift. Uh, I'm trying to think of other things that are recommended a lot. I'm going to be honest, the form's anonymous. Just a reminder, the form's anonymous. I know I never said that, like, on the announcements, but let's pretend I did. So the form's anonymous. So I don't actually, if you recommend a song, I don't actually see who you are. With all that said, if I, if in the span of five minutes, I can see the timestamps. If in the span of five minutes... I get 20 suggestions wow. for the same song. I know it was the same person. So if you're going to spam my form, you got to be a little more clever about it. 
They should make different names, maybe do it periodically, like yeah, yeah. spam it every five minutes or something. No, 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 not, no, no, not no, just like, immediately. No, no, like if you, I, 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 this is great. I'm telling people how to gain my form. If you, uh, no, if you put your song in, wait a couple of periods, put another song in, a different song, and then another, another couple of periods. And put that song in again. That's smart. And if you keep that on loop and make it a little irregular, I will get fooled eventually. Don't do that, by the way. Don't do that. Don't do it. Don't do it. Unless it's a song I like, then you can do it. Is there any upcoming very important events coming for the class of 2025? Uh, yes, there is one big one. So we're filming this at the end of October. Uh, on October 13th, we're going to have the uh, a, a movie night where oh, yeah. there's, there's going to be two, basically, two different events. Uh, one for the elementary school kids and one for the seniors. So for the elementary school kids, it's just going to be, uh, we're playing the movie Elemental. It's a Pixar movie that came out a year or two ago, a while ago. Uh, so the kids are going to, you know, we're selling tickets for that. There's going to be some snacks. They're going to sit there, watch the movie. The seniors, you're just going to come. We're going to have snacks. We're going to have offerings. But any any seniors can come. Uh, we're going to play the movie. Uh, it's going to be late at night. And even the... It's a Sunday, but the day afterwards is a delayed opening, so don't worry That's about nice. time. It'll it'll be it'll be. I personally like the suggestion of Fer Ferris Bueller's Day Off. I saw the form. That's mm -hmm. the one I voted for personally. Yeah. Not sure about you. Well, I I believe I believe in a secret the secret ballot, secret so I, secret I, I ballot. Won't, I, won't, I won't reveal which one I voted for. Uh, it's a mystery. It is a mystery. You can probably guess though. Do you have any closing arguments you would like to tell the people of MHS? <sighs> What, what, do I, what do I want to say? You know what? I'm just going to reiterate what I said to all you guys in the auditorium on the first day. This year, I hope you've all had a great start to your year, or that you've all had a great September, uh, especially with for like the seniors with the college admissions, that process starting. But I hope as the year goes on, we're going to have a great senior year, a fun senior year, and a memorable senior year. So I wish you all the best. I wish you all the best for the, for the rest of the year, and I hope to see you again in a month or two. Sounds awesome. We're going to have a great senior year.